at PSC School. And I'm Jaden. I am American. I, I study at BIC School. Today, we are truly honored to introduce our project as below. Climate change is becoming more and more complicated and unpredictable. Crops are increasingly unstable and the environment is deteriorating. At the same time, result from a shortage of workers, smart agriculture is one of the trends that is being very interested and researched today. So the needed components are I do no uno board, make you edit shield, LCD screen, temperature and humidity sensor, soil moisture sensor, relay module, mini submersible water pump, LED light. To connect this on, we need to use cable XH 2.54 type 4 wire USB type C cable. So, for it to work properly, we need to connect these as follows. First, connect the Uno Arduino board and the Maker Edit Shield together like this. Secondly, take a Type 4 cable and connect it to the LCD screen. And connect it to the I2C pin. So for the temperature and humidity sensor, we will need to use the, this cable to connect it. We need to connect the green one to the negative and the purple one to the positive. This will connect to the D11 pin. So the next one will be the soil moisture sensor. We need to use the type two wire cable for this sensor. Then take the three wire cable and connect and connect to the A3 pin. Then this is the relay module. We connect the tube here and take the type 3 wire cable and plug it in here. Like this and we'll, it will be in the D10. Lastly, the LED light. This is the easiest one. It will connect to the D9. For it to work, we need to do some coding, so let's get started. Load the program for the circus test run. After that, Use the watering model for the flower pot. The function of this is to measure the soil, soil moisture displays on the LCD screen. Then automatically they turn on the water pump to water the plant when the humidity is below the allowable level measures the air humidity and temperature displays on the LCD screen warns with light when 
humidity or temperature is above the allowable level. If the ambient temperature or air humidity is too high, the LED will be turned down to warning. If the soil or moist, moist, moisture uh, is equal or less than 40%, the system will turn off the pump. If the, the humidity is if more, more than 40%, the system will turn on the, the pump. Remember, it's necessary to connect properly the red wire of the pump to the positive foot and the black wire of the pump to the negative foot of the low switch circuits. Incorrect connection may damage the pump. Do not let the pump run continuously for too long so the code is pro programmed to pump intermittently for every 5 seconds. So this is the end of our experiment. Goodbye!